Hey, it's Ted here. We're working on an Onion generator in the lab. This is a recent donation um, and the first time we've really gotten into it. Uh, I've got students uh, doing some general maintenance right now. And one of my famous students is taking uh, the end cap. He's taking that off the heat exchanger and he's taking everything out of the heat exchanger that was blocking the water passage. So this is why you need to do the maintenance on these uh, periodically. So here it is. Here's what we have so far that he's digging out of the end of the heat exchanger. So great exercise in what you really have to do. And with a sound guard on this, it would be very, very difficult to get at that. But you would definitely want to get in here and make sure all those passageways are clean. Back flush it when you're done, probably. Makes a little bit of a mess, but that would clean the rest of the tubes out. So he's got it about 90% empty, but that was pretty close to probably a full blockage of the end of that heat exchanger for sure. There's a lot of debris in here, and I guess probably there was no uh, C strainer either, so to see that much debris in there. So we're uh, got another one over here, and he is has taken the end cap off and he's finding in color pieces. This is an old generator we've had in a boat here. We finally got out and uh, access in that boat was very difficult to do this, but you can see he's still fishing in color pieces out. It's stuffed in the exchange in the, in the tubes. Oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah, so we'll have to probably get the other end off and we'll flush it backwards with a cleaner. I've got a special cleaner that clean out the tubes. Yeah, so here's the inside of the heat exchanger, and this definitely has not ever been serviced. You can see the top, some of them are blocked. So we're gonna we're gonna clean the tubes out for sure on this. And then uh, we pulled the anode out, and this was what was left of the anode. Absolutely nothing. So that has probably it looked to me as if that had never been changed on the generator. So that's another service item that uh, will allow you to protect it from rotting away, but obviously that was never done. So just another quick one, show you what uh, we're working on here in the lab in their diesel class. If you like that video, hit that subscribe and like button. We'll see you in the next one.